So yeah, it's Tuesday night, and I was like, I'm sitting here bored. My sister's washing her dog. Um, my mom is asleep. My dad is cooking. Um, Angie, Angie, I think she's like headed home from work. And Bay, I don't know what the heck he's doing right now. So I'm really bored. I'm not got nobody to talk to. I need somebody to talk to. Y'all get bored easily. Like I like, I get bored quick. So I don't have anybody to talk to me. I'm like, oh, hello, like who's gonna talk to me? Who's, you know? So like, let me just pick up. Let me pause this. Watching team mom. Are you nervous? No. Yeah. So let me pause that. Cause I don't want no copyright YouTube. I don't want no copyright. Anywho, so yeah, I'm just sitting here watching TV right now. It's really nothing going on. It's really nothing to do. Let me just gets my camera in. Okay, yeah. But yeah, it's really nothing to do. I'm just sitting here chilling out. Um, I had a bowl of cereal from Cocoa Puffs. Okay, credit for Cocoa Puffs. <laughs> no, was it Reese Puffs? Cocoa Puffs. Yeah, I had like Cocoa, Reese Puffs, whatever for dinner because I didn't feel like cooking and there really wasn't anything. Um, there really wasn't anything to cook, honestly. Well, it's stuff to cook. I really didn't want to cook. That's what I'm trying to say. So, yeah, guys, everything is going pretty good. I want to come and check in with y'all. What are y'all doing tonight? Did y'all have to go to work tonight? Like, what? What did you do? Well, you know, what happened? What really happened, guys? Y'all, I got to come talk to you. I got to come clean. I've been feeling torn in between the two. Like, I feel so torn because... Don't get me wrong. I absolutely love doing my own thing. I love it. But I feel like I can do my own thing and I can add more to what I'm doing. And a part of me wants to, like, for, okay, first off, me doing the whole website thing, like, yes, I'm still going to do that no matter what. But I feel like I can add more to it. I might be able to start an accessory line that I might want to do. And I'm also talking about going to work. Like... I love doing my own thing and I feel like I'm going to continue and always do my own thing and add more to like my own business and my, you know, get my tax ID, get my whole, so I, I'm still going to do all that stuff, but I don't know, I'm kind of torn, like, a part of me wants to get a new job at like a new, you know, daycare center that I'm actually going to enjoy, have better hours and things like that, and then a part of me wants to take up what I went to high school for, which was medical office management. And I kind of want to, you know, I don't think it's called a hospital registrar or something like that. But it, just, it doesn't even have to be in the hospital. But, you know, when you go to the emergency room and you go, you know, you go to the patient check-in, that person who's at the front desk who gets, like, your first name, last name, your birthday, what are your symptoms, you know, what's bothering you, and then they tell you to have a C&T, you know, the doctor or nurse calls you back into the hospital. That's kind of what I want to do. I want to be the person at the front desk that kind of gets your information, like, oh, what's bothering you? What brings you in today? What's going on? Girl, you sick girl a sharp bitch your head off what you got the flu oh my goodness like i want to be the person like what's your first name what's your last name oh, okay really hmm. what's bobby oh my goodness are you finna have a baby are you have all your contractually like, i want to be that person that like gets your symptoms gets your first name gets your last name and they're like okay girl you know you can you can sit for the doctor you know they'll heal they'll be out here shortly you know just have a seat be like are you sick you got a virus well back up like i want to be that person that gets the um you know the information when you first walk into a hospital or I could be the person that works at a doctor's office and answering the phone like hello hi how are you doing today you want to set up an appointment oh what's bothering you your tooth or your wisdom teeth is coming out oh I'm so sorry to hear that what day works best for you like I don't know I just want to do something like that so I'm kind of torn between doing that and then I'm torn between 
getting another job at a child care center because I did that for all my life. Like, my mom has had a home daycare for, like, 15 years. And my aunt had a home daycare. I used to babysit kids. I used to um, go to other people's houses and kind of nanny. I used to spend night over people's houses and, you know, babysit their kids and things like that. So, it's kind of like, well, do I want to be still be a daycare teacher and go there and meet new kids and have new parents and you know do fun activities with them and you know grow and have a connection with them yeah I just I don't know but whatever I do pick to do I'm still going to have my own businesses with the S on the end because I'm going to start another business besides my graphic business shameless plug if you need a banner logo thumbnail or in Slay, check out my link will be down in the description box to my website, Dream Graphics, Big Cartel. Come check it out. So yeah, guys, I don't know. I'm torn. Can y'all let me know in the comments what would y'all do? Like, how do y'all feel? Like, what would y'all do if y'all were in my situation? So let me know. I just I don't know. I want to do something that I enjoy, and I would enjoy either one of those positions. And I want to do something that I could like move up in that type of field. But I'm still going to have my own business. I still want to have my own businesses. I still want to, you know, be able to come home and go into my office and work, you know, at my computer and. Well, who bought this or who bought that? You know, just fun things like that. So, y'all, I'm torn with what I really want to do. I don't know. I had to figure it out. I think I figured it out fast, okay? I feel like I got so used to going to work, like getting up, getting dressed, talking to my coworkers, you know, like having something going on. And now that I'm home, I enjoy it. But, and I still want to be my own boss. But then I kind of just want to, you know, you know, do something else, you know. I kind of want to make sure I have something that's steady into my businesses, you know. Get started up and get to going right. But even when my businesses are started up and they're going right and, you know, they're being successful. You know, I have clientele and I have sales that are coming in back to back to back. I still want to, you know, have a job or, you know until I get older you know you know things like that but for right now it's kind of what I want to do y'all I don't know I don't know what to do I don't know what to do <sighs> I'm trying to make a decision and I've been like on like line like looking at jobs like wanting to turn in my resume I'm just like yeah because I know for a fact like I feel like presentation is everything you put some makeup on you put a nice outfit on you put you get your hair done you know what i'm saying you have your cover letter your resume your references you know what i'm saying and you talk for that position like you know telling them you know just kind of not not tell them what they want to hear but you talk a good game basically when you go to these interviews i just feel like i'm gonna get these jobs and i'm just like Ugh, like you know am i really i don't know and then i'm at home and we have a waiting list and so it's like all these kids are coming in and I'm really enjoying doing this too and I kind of feel like I'm doing too much at one time I kind of feel like I you know I'm trying to like bouncing all over the place like I'm doing too much at one time I want to do so much but I can't do everything I'm not like I don't got no clones you know what I'm saying I ain't got like six of me so one can go to the hospital one can go to the daycare one can run my business what you know I don't have that it's just one of me so I have to pick I ain't got no twin if I had a twin I'm pretty sure my twin would be doing what I want to do so I have to figure it out guys oh I gotta figure it out. I gotta figure it out fast. I gotta figure it out real, 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 real fast, real fast. So, yeah, guys, I just wanted to come and talk to you guys for a little bit. You know, catch up, have a little nighttime chit chat. You know, hello. So yeah, that's all I'm doing. I'm watching Team Mom. I'm watching like the original with like Macy, Farrah, Amber, and Caitlyn. Those are my favorites. That's like why I started watching 16 and Pregnant and then I started watching Teen Mom. I absolutely love them. Especially watching the old episodes like season one where they were like, you know, Amber and Gary thought they were going to be together and Ryan and Macy were going through their stuff. And like, you know, I like watching the old episodes. I can watch these episodes over and over and over and over and over again. That's what I do. I watch old episodes. Like, I think yesterday I was watching Married to Medicine season one. And they're about to come out with season five. Now, I watched all the seasons. I just wanted to go back and do, like, a little recap <laughs> of everything for just no reason. Just to do it. Just because I was bored. I wanted to do something. <coughs> 
so yeah y'all that's how it's going on so i'm gonna finish watching tv also the little face scrub stuff that i tried it worked pretty good i liked it well it worked pretty good i don't really know the results results yet because this is my first day using it but it made my skin feel very cool and focus focus hello yeah it made my skin feel very cool and it made it feel very refreshed like you know very refreshed so i'm hoping i'm gonna keep using it i'm gonna use it every single day when i come downstairs i'm leaving downstairs and down in the guest bathroom i'm gonna use it every single day so that i cannot forget and i'm gonna use it every day and hopefully you know it's a week two weeks three weeks four weeks five weeks six weeks you know what's what have you it goes up from there but yeah, y'all, it's 9.58, so I'm about to go ahead and end this vlog. I've been talking for 10 minutes, Lord, okay? Give me a thumbs up if you stay the full minutes and watch me talk. Thank you. <laughs> but yeah, guys, so I guess I'll see y'all tomorrow. I just wanted to come and do a little chit-chat with y'all because I wasn't doing anything. I was just sitting here. I was bored. I wanted to talk to you guys. So yeah, I will see you guys tomorrow. Good night, love. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Subscribe if you would like to. And comment down below. Peace.